Today marks a new push in addressing the homeless crisis in our region. A new homeless shelter is now open in the Midway District. CBS 8's Chris Grow live with more on that. Plus this new count that says homelessness is actually rising downtown, isn't it, Chris? And it's something that we believe we've been seeing with our own eyes and the latest numbers here from this homeless report certainly support that. But what's happening here in the Midway today is the first day, which might be the first opportunity for some of these people to get their life back on track. In fact, we saw one of the first people that will be going and joining this brand new bridge shelter here in the Midway District. Uh, that gentleman spoke with us for a quite a little bit of short time and just basically told us uh, that the outreach is what made him aware of the shelter and this unique opportunity. And he's going to be about one of 150 people that will be staying here now. And what makes this shelter so unique is the services that it provides. It's not just a bed as well as some food and a hot shower, but there's also going to be mental health treatment, drug treatment. There will be disease screenings, case management and housing navigation. What's happening right now is those who are going to be staying here, they're going through that screening process. They're going through a little bit of that initial steps there to have a chance at staying sheltered here. And one of the unique things is that this is going to be managed by the Alpha Project, a nonprofit that has a lot of experience running these type of shelters. We spoke with the head of the Alpha Project about the timeline for some of these individuals, whether there would be a mandatory uh, you know, amount of time that someone has to stay or cannot stay. And this is actually a very unique response that he gave us. Take a listen. Yeah, are you going to get your life back together in 120 days? So some people do. Um, some people are here 30 days, 60 days, some here a year or so. So as long as they're safe, uh, wrapped around with all the services here, the, the uh, medical clinics, the mental health. And essentially what you just heard him saying is that there is no time limit. There is no uh, minimum amount of time or mandatory amount of time that maximum that you have to stay. You can stay here until you can get back on your feet. Now, back to those numbers that we heard about in the latest downtown survey, homeless, homelessness survey. The uh, downtown San Diego partnership said that more than 1600 people they surveyed again that being downtown in the month of August. That's a new record high. Something else that a lot of the people working on this specific issue are taking into account as we move forward. Reporting from the Midway, I'm Chris Grove for CBS 8.